Welcome to cyberspace. You have been contracted to retrieve data from a secure network. First, you will need to hack a vulnerable node. Look at a small node and select it to begin. Your basic tool of hacking is a virus. You can inject the virus into any of the blue antivirus programs. To begin hacking, select an antivirus program. To capture this node, the virus must spread into the core, shown in yellow. Select the core to inject the virus. The antivirus programs will destroy the spreading virus as soon as they come into contact. You must inject the virus elsewhere to capture this node. Press the back button to restart your hacking attempt. The virus has successfully reached the core. This node and its monetary assets are now under your control. Press the back button to exit the node. You now have additional funds, which you can use to purchase software. Press the back button to open the menu. Purchase additional viruses to improve your hacking abilities. Press the back button to close the store and continue hacking. You can now select a new node to hack. A node's security is based on its size and the number of firewalls protecting it. Firewalls are represented as rings rotating around the node. The smaller the node and the fewer the firewalls around it, the easier it will be to hack. now have multiple viruses. You can inject one virus at a time, or inject multiple viruses at once. Both strategies will be necessary to capture more secure nodes. You can also purchase Hydras, a special type of software. Hydras can capture nodes without the need to hack them manually. Open the menu and purchase a Hydra now. To 
install the Hydra, select one of your captured nodes. Hydras can capture nodes that are not protected by a shield. The Hydra will spread through the network and capture any node that does not have a shield around it. If necessary, you can rotate your viewing direction at any time. You can now afford to purchase another virus. Since viruses are not consumed upon use, they represent a permanent upgrade and are therefore your most important purchases. With more viruses, you can capture larger and more secure nodes. Some nodes contain highly valuable data, shown in green. These nodes are worth much more money than other nodes of their size. Error. 
Hydras can only be installed in captured nodes. Sentinel nodes are shown in blue. Sentinel nodes add shields and one firewall to all connected nodes. Capturing a sentinel node will therefore make the nearby nodes more vulnerable. Some nodes are too secure to capture. If a node is too difficult to hack, you can exit the node and return after you've purchased more viruses or reduce the node's security. You now have access to exploits. Exploits can be used to make the network more vulnerable. Use the exploit on a sentinel node to remove shields and firewalls. This will make the network more vulnerable to viruses and hydras.
A captured node removes one firewall from every connected node. You can therefore weaken a highly secured node by capturing those surrounding it until all firewalls have been removed. If you wish to enter a node, select viruses from the menu. You have excess funds available. Use your accumulated funds to purchase more software. It is usually advantageous to use all of the different types of software that are available to you. Error. Hydras can only be installed in captured nodes.
If you wish to enter a error, hydra. If you wish to enter a node, select viruses. For error, hydras can only be installed in captured nodes. Keep in mind that you do not need to inject all your viruses at once. You can choose to inject just one virus at a time, and continue hacking after it has cleared away the nearby antivirus programs. You can now inject one or more of your remaining viruses. By injecting viruses in separate waves, you can more effectively clear out the antivirus programs. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
Thank you. 